the bad seed. Same author as last time. Dominic put in a request that, oh, backpack tomorrow. You don't need a backpack tomorrow. You don't have to bring it to school if you don't want. No backpacks, no lunches. Come just as you are. All right, the bad seed. Last week I read The Good Egg. Same author, you can totally tell. The illustrations are very similar. Um, but last time we read a story about a egg that was too good and he needed to chill out a little bit, right? And relax about what other friends were doing around him. And this time we're reading about the bad seed. So then at the end, maybe you can think about what the theme is to this story. And is it better to be a good egg or is it better to be the bad seed or is it better to be somewhere in the middle? You can bring your backpack if you want to, because we don't leave until 11. So you can bring your backpack and we'll just leave it at the school while we're away at the basketball game. All right, here we go. Okay, let me know if it's too far away and if I, or if I need to bring it up closer, I can do that. I'm a bad seed. A bad seed. Oh yeah, he's bad all right. Yes, he is a sunflower seed. Oh yeah, it's true. The other seeds, they look at me and they say, that seed is so bad. Rude. When they think I'm not listening, they mumble. There goes bad seed. He does look mad, doesn't he? But I can hear them. I have good hearing for a seed. Oh gosh, then that's probably not a very nice thing to hear about yourself, huh? How bad am I? You really want to know? Yes, we really want to know. Well, I never put things back where they belong. I am late to everything. I tell long jokes with no punchlines. Whoa, that's pretty bad, you guys. That's real bad. I never wash my hands or my feet. I lie about pointless stuff. I cut in line every time, even at the outhouse. Oh my goodness. I stare at everybody. I glare at everybody, even babies apparently. I finish everybody's sentences and I never listen. And I do lots of other bad things too. Know why? Because I'm a bad seed. A bad seed. I just can't help it. Sure, I wasn't always this bad. I was more, I was born a humble seed and a simple sunflower in an unremarkable field. I had a big family. Look at that big family. They're so happy. Seeds everywhere. We found ways of having fun. We were close. A very bad seed. But then, the petals dropped. Oh, you guys, this is too sad. And our flower drooped. Oh, can we even go on from this? This is getting really sad, you guys. I didn't want to choose a sad story. This is terrible. Should I just close it? Should we just be done? No, we can't. We can't. <laughs> Let's move on. It's kind of a blur. Oh, now it got really scary. <gasps> no! 
I remember a bag. What kind of bag is that? You probably can't read it backwards. Maybe you can. It says sunflower seeds, delicious. Do you recognize that kind of bag? They put them in a bag of sunflower seeds to be eaten. Everything went dark. And then, then, oh my goodness. A giant. This is not good, not good at all. He's at a baseball game. That's where you eat sunflower seeds. Is that him? Is that the little seed? I can't bear to look. My dog is for a walk right now. And I don't know where my cat is. We're in the middle of a scary part of the book and you're asking about my dog and my cat? Hold on. I thought I was a goner. I thought I was done for. I screamed and hollered, ah! Look at him, he's so scared. And then, but I was spit out at the last possible second. Oh boy, he is flying now. I flew through the air and landed under the bleachers with a thud. Oh my gosh, what is he in? What did he land in under the bleachers? That looks gross. When I woke up, it was dark outside. A wad of gum had softened my fall. I felt okay, but something had changed in me. I'd become a different seed entirely. I'd become, dun, 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 a bad seed. <gasps> there was the moment when he changed. He was a happy seed living in a sunflower, and then he had some bad luck, didn't he? And he changed in that exact moment. A bad seed. Whoa, he looks pretty bad. Yes, he was in the gum. That's right, I stopped smiling. I kept to myself, I drifted. I was friend to nobody and bad to everybody. I was lost on purpose. I lived inside a soda can. Oh, little seed, you're always welcome inside my soda can. I would take care of you, huh? You all know I would take care of this seed in my soda can. I didn't care and it suited me. Oh, he is just, he is not doing too well anymore, is he? Poor little dude. Oh, until recently. I've made a big decision. I've decided I don't want to be a bad seed anymore. I'm ready to be happy. It's hard to be good when you're so used to being bad, but I'm trying. I'm taking it one day at a time. Sure, I still forget to listen, and I still show up late, and I still talk during movies, and I do all kinds of other bad stuff. Wait, he turned into a third grader? Is that so bad? He forgets to listen, he shows up late, and he talks during movies. Those are third graders' favorite things to do. Oh, I see how it is. I'm just kidding, guys. I'm just kidding. It set it up perfectly for that little joke, didn't it? It did. Oh, Rihanna's getting smart with me, sassy girl. Wow. I can picture you saying that, Rihanna. But I also say thank you, and I say please, and I smile, and I hold doors open for people. Not always, but sometimes. Wait, that sounds like a third grader too. Third graders say thank you, and they say please, and they're always smiling, and 
They will even hold a door open. Wow, I guess their graders are pretty amazing. And even though I still feel bad sometimes, I also feel kind of good. It's sort of a mix. All I can do is keep trying and keep thinking. Maybe I'm not such a bad seed after all. Oh, now he's cute when he's happy. Hello, Aaliyah. I'm gonna wave to you. Whoa, Ada with the emojis. Those are amazing. Oh, here are his friends. Hey, look there, there goes that bad seed. Actually, he's not all that bad anymore. I heard that. Oh my gosh, he is so cute. Can we keep him? We can, we can keep him. I'm gonna bring this book and add it to our library. <gasps> Yay, so you can fight over it tomorrow in class. <laughs> Just kidding, we'll take turns with it. Maybe I'll read it aloud to everyone who didn't get a chance to listen to it tonight um, because we have some time before we leave to go on our field trip. So, oh, somebody already knows the theme. Is it that being bad is so fun? Is it that being bad is better than being good? How about being bad is so stressful, but so is being good? 